Okay, so we're going to do a comparison between uh, the various gust locks out there. So the other day I received my ultimate gust lock from Anti Splat Arrow, and we're going to compare it to the Russian built homemade gust lock. Now, this might look like your ordinary PVC gust lock, but this is actually imported PVC straight from Moscow. Okay, secret uh, components that we can't divulge right now. So if you look at it, the engineering, th there's a lot of engineering in it. The time to build takes hours and hours and hours. Uh, you have to use epoxy and uh, utensils to cut and to paint it with this beautiful finish. So when you think about it, we have as much money wrapped up in this as we, as we do just buying this straight from anti splat era. So today we're going to run a side-by-side -side comparison. We're, we're going to put the plane in the wind tunnel and we're going to show you exactly how these two perform. We'll be right back with that. Okay, so here we have the ultimate gus lock installed. Just as advertised, uh, it's pretty easy once you play with it for a couple minutes. I marked my line here and um, it works just as advertised. As you can see, it's, it really isn't going anywhere and um, I have a lot of faith in this product. Okay, so here's another angle of the anti-splat uh, ultimate gust lock installed. And now with the help of my uh, assistant, Vladimir, we'll start up the wind tunnel test. Hi, Vlad. <laughs> Go! Good. So as you can see, the rudder did not move at all, and everything operated just as it was supposed to. What do you say, Vlad? Is it still uh, still attached? Still attached. Everything good. No punctures. No holes. Beautiful. So it did. Uh, it performed admirably. Okay. So here we have the homemade Russian gust lock installed. As you can see, uh, it fits very well. And it's, it snugs the, everything up very nicely. Things don't seem to want to move at all. So we'll go to the wind tunnel test and we'll see what we can do with that. All right, Vlad, now we're going to test the Russian homemade uh, gust lock. So go ahead and start up the wind tunnel. Go, go, go 50% power. Closer. Closer. Give it full power. Let's see what we've got. Obviously, that was a very costly experiment. We tried to save a few dollars here, but it ended up costing much more here. If you want to save your airplane, forget this and stick with the ultimate gust line. The anti spot arrow device obviously was superior in this test, but we put it to the test for uh, more than what it's designed to do. And Vlad is demonstrating now just how useful this tool can be. <laughs> <laughs>